Hello, people trying to make a Gary's Mod server. No! What is oh, that's the kid I'm making the video for. Uh, say, say hello to YouTube. Oh, there, okay. There we go. Oh, yes, yeah, okay. Now, first, you have to go to your router. It might be router routerlogin.net but it might be different for you so if it's different for you I think it's like 198.162.1.1 might be that or it might be point two. I don't know just keep trying it and uh Yeah. Cool. Thanks. Thanks, man. Yeah. But mine is routerlogin.net or I don't know what I just did. And the default name and password is admin and password. Those are the defaults. Now I have Netgear. Netgear is the easiest because it's the only one I've done it on. But I think it's the easiest. If it's on like Verizon or something like that, I can't help you. I've I don't know how to do it because I don't have it. But basically, this is what you want to look for. Usually, it's in the advanced, and then advanced setup, and then it should be port forwarding slash port triggering. If it just says port forwarding, just click on it, see what it says, and if it looks like this, then you're doing it right. Now, this will be empty if you have Netgear. What you want to do is, if it's empty, add custom service. And then type the name, like Gmod. Oh, there we go. And then the ports that I'm going to give you in a second, they'll be in the description. You put in those ports, these two ports. And then you select. Let me just this okay so yeah I have Gary's I already have this one set up so just like act like you're creating a new service create a new one name it Gary's mod leave this alone and then put in this port for the starting port 27014 and then for the ending port 27050 and then those are the two ports that worked for me. It might be different for you, but I'm pretty sure these two ports will work for you too. Um, and then this is your IP address, your computer IP address. So what we want to do is go to CMD, just type that in the search, and then go to IP config. And then a bunch of stuff like this will pop up. And then you want to scroll down and find the IPv6 address. Oh no, wrong one. Um well, this is how you find it. You just want to look for the IPv4 phone IPv4 address and that is your computer address right there. So you just copy this into there right there. Oh dear. What did I do? 2168. I think that was a 1. Yeah, you just copy it in there. Yeah, that was a 1. Okay. And then you click apply. And then that part is done. And the rest is done in the game. But there's one more thing that happens to me. But I don't know if it happens to you. But I would just recommend doing it always. If your friends get kicked by Lula Airs. It's because of some stupid reason. Uh, this code right here, this fixes it. So SV under slash kick, kicker, something, zero. You just put that in the console in the game. Yeah, okay. Now this part is okay. done. I'm going to go to the game. Okay, from here, what you want to do is go to start new game. 
and just pick any map you want. I'll just pick flat grass and go to single. Click on this. Ah, I'm trying to make it, and your thing's in the way. Okay. Drop down the menu. I usually do 32 because that's what works for me. I tried 64, and my friends tried to join, and it was, it said the server was full. So, I'm I just pick 32. Uh, okay, and then usually what I do is I say. Awesome, awesome, right there, like that. And for some reason, when I type this in, a lot of people join. And then when I type in, like, the best around, no one seems to join. I think it's, like, alphabetically ordered, like, server list. So just something that begins with A works good. And then just set this to whatever you want. If you really want to like limit how many things, like if some people join that just want to fuck with you, they can. You can set like a how many props you want. I just do it to nine, what unlimited. So when me and my friend just want to do some cool stuff, it doesn't get in the way. So yeah, it just figure that all out. Just put nines in all of it if you want, or limit it if you want to. And then limit phase gun, I don't do that. No clip. When you check it, it means on, by the way. God mode, God mode I don't do that. Player damage players, and there's like PvP, and then, uh, yeah. And then, you gotta make server name, and then make sure this is unchecked. This, I don't know what it does, so I just put poop in there. So, now I'm gonna start it. And you gotta wait for this. Load the world. Takes a while. And I'll be back when it's done. Okay, now that you're in the game, see, I'm in the game, I'm playing, I'm having a good time, good time. You know, yeah. Okay, once you're in the game, you can just control V that code in there. It will be in the description, and people can join. So, I'm going to ask you to join my game. Game to show that it works. Right there. <laughs> I don't know, I'll send my friend... Join my game, please. And any of you know why I get 30 FPS using fraps, even though I was just getting 200? Why does that happen? I just want to know. Because it makes it pretty hard to record videos if I'm getting 30 FPS. Look at there, it says join. Phone, it's not the time. I think car's too low. Yeah. Just fix that, you know? And this. You go up. Right there. So five. Perfect. Sweet. I should have Oh! That's not dandy. Is he gonna spawn in? Come on, come on, dude. Dude, I got time scheduled, dude. Gotta get this video done, dude. I told you if you put in, like, A in your name. Yeah. Okay, well this is how, that is how, you make a server. And this is my car. It's nice. 
Yeah, it sure is. Oh, and you'd have to have a pretty decent system to uh, run a server for like more than three people and good internet connection. Yeah, look at I have pretty good internet connection. He's getting 87 ping. Or you, because you're gonna be watching this video. Yeah. Okay. Well, thank you for watching, and have a nice day.